Hi, I'm Adelheid and this is about Bill and me. We met in 1975 at a pub in London. It was some kind of feminist event. <laughs> and I went there because I thought I could relax a bit. And Bill went there because he knew there were women there. <clears throat> that's what he told me later. And that's where we found each other. And we never really lost each other again. At the time he had just read Philip Age's book, Inside the Company, and he was, uh, he talked about it non-stop. And we met with Phil and I mean, I, I loved that and I was so excited and um, it was great. And our first trip together was to Portugal because it was the year after the Carnation Revolution and we wanted to see at least a part of it. And <clears throat> while we were driving through Spain, we would ride everywhere with a felt tip pen, where it was possible, down with Franco. Franco Abajo. We liked that. <laughs> and um, then we lived together for 12 years and we lived in Berlin and we lived in London and in Berkeley and then in London again. And then we started going back and forth between Los Angeles and Freiburg and then Washington and Freiburg. And I, I always loved Washington. And we have a marvelous son, Alexander, he's here with his family. Hi, Alexander. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Joseph. Hi, Nathanael. Hello, I'm glad you're here. And I mean, you all know that for Bill, his political work was the most important part of his life. And it was important, it still is. And I mean, we were important too, but... <laughs> and um, we used to eat bagel with cream cheese and go to the cinema and talk a lot. And we also would sing a lot, like at, at parties or in the car. And one of Bill's favorite songs was, um, besides Joe Hill, was Go to Sleep, You Weary Hobo by Woody Guthrie. And I would like to sing that for him now. Go to sleep, you weary hobo. Let the towns drift slowly by. Do you hear the steel rail humming? That's a hobo's lullaby. Do not think about tomorrow. Let tomorrow come and go. Tonight you're in a nice warm box car, safe from all the wind and snow. I know. The police cause you trouble, they cause trouble everywhere. But when you die and go to heaven, you won't find no policeman there. And now comes the last verse, the most important one. And it, I'll tell you why in a minute. I know your clothes are torn and ragged, and your hair is turning gray. Lift your head and smile at trouble. You'll find happiness someday. And each time we came to the line, lift your head and smile at trouble, Bill would go like this. Hi trouble, hi trouble. And then we would sing it again. I know your clothes are torn and ragged and your hair is turning gray. Lift your head and smile at trouble. Hi trouble, hi. You'll find happiness someday. Thank you.